Sagittarius, welcome. I am giving you a special birthday reading. Oh, look, <laughs> we've already got cards. And this is my happy birthday to you. Um, I've got a special offer as well. I want you to stay tuned and listen to it. Um, these cards, though, are about your year ahead. What the advice is for you in the year ahead. And we'll have this foundation card as well. So stay tuned to the very end of this message and I'll tell you what this means for you. Did you know that your birthday is a great time to treat yourself to a solar report? What's a solar report? Some of you are asking. Well, it's a year ahead astrological report showing what the next 12 months will likely bring for you based upon the time when the sun reaches the exact degree of your natal chart sun. What does it cover? Well, it covers all 12 areas of life represented by all 12 houses. Yes, that's relationships, romance, it's career and money, it's family and healing. And what you'll know from this report is your main focus for the year ahead, where you're most and least supported in your efforts, where you're the most lucky, where you're the most challenged, right? Very important because some of you, you know, maybe you want to focus on your career, but actually the most support you're getting in the year ahead is with home and family. It's not that you can't be a success with that, but getting that information really helps to equip you with the challenges in the year ahead and take advantage of the good luck and fortune in the areas of life where you're getting it astrologically. Another thing that you'll know from this report is where the major changes are most likely to occur for you in the year ahead, where you can expect the unexpected, what is your blind spot, where are you most prone to deception and lack of clarity. This is very helpful so that if you're making very important decisions in life to make these major changes, you can kind of get a second set of lenses to say, you know, Probably in this area, I might not be seeing things exactly clearly or getting all the information. So I'm going to double check. I'm going to do my homework to really make for sure that I pivot optimally. Another thing that you can learn from this report is what are the main pain points in the year ahead that you're likely to occur because that's going to show where to focus your self-healing where to work on self-love, where you need to be gentle with yourself over the year ahead, very important for your spiritual growth. And also what's likely to make you angry over the next year, very important for doing damage control. You know, it comes up for all of us, but you know, when we are forewarned, we are forearmed. And I think all this information that you can get out of a solar report is going to really equip you to make the most of all the energies that are uniquely up ahead for you and you alone. So if you're interested in this 30 minute reading, I am offering it as a special for you know, my happy birthday to you. It's 30 minutes for $50. And who might be interested in this? Well, if you're having a birthday right now, um, I'm filming this during Sagittarius month. So <laughs> Sagittarius, um, you would be interested, I think. And if you just had a birthday, Scorpio, uh, Scorpios would be interested. And then up ahead, we've got Capricorn season. So if you've got a birthday coming up or you just had one or you're in the middle of your birthday season, absolutely would be a good time to take advantage and get a snapshot of what's coming up for you in the next solar year. And if you want to take advantage of that offer, then make sure to reach out to me at crownedones.weebly.com. I will have the link in the description box and the comments down below. All right, Sagittarius, thanks for waiting to the end of the video. I am pulling these card meanings from the Sacred Tra Traveler Oracle cards for those of you who are interested. Love this deck. Had it for years. It's great for giving advice on where you're going next on your journey. And you got a journey quite ahead of you with the next solar year. And so for me, these cards are telling me that you got big decisions to make in the year ahead. And for some of you, the de decisions become glaringly obvious when you reach an impasse. Some of you are coming to a point in the road where you're going to have to decide this way or that way, or do I even just turn back around and go in the other direction? If you hit a wall, it seems, if you get some kind of blockage in your life, in terms of you moving forward in the direction that you're trying to move, well, Spirit is saying, look, it's time to reflect and redirect your energy. And I really feel this is you, Sagittarius. 
Look at that fire. That is so Sagittarius. Um, and this card is saying, wise leader, you are a beacon for others. Well, you know, Sagittarius is the most evolved of all three fire signs, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. And so both of these cards are about you shining that light for others to see. Yeah, it might take some discovery and getting to that discovery point might take some reflecting and redirecting of your energy. But I think that whatever decision you arrive at will be from you having done the work to seek the truth on the matter. And it says here, you stand in the light of truth. So look, spirit is definitely putting it out there for you. So I'm hearing seek and you shall find, okay? I'm also getting intuitively that some of you are being shown a truth to take a leadership role. And it might not be easy. Again, it might be that you think you're going in one direction. You hit an impasse. You have to do more discovery of what the whole truth of the matter is. You make a decision. You lead the way for others to follow in your footsteps. And so remember this in the year ahead. I'm also hearing people are watching you. They're watching your example. And I think that a lot of times I'm hearing you got to do a gut check over the next year. Is this really an integrity with you? Is this an alignment with you, what you're doing? Because by you bravely stepping into aligning your actions with your feelings and your belief, you're really a shining a light for other people to do the same. So best of wishes in the year ahead, Sagittarius. And I hope you've had a wonderful birthday and a wonderful new year ahead.